I'm sorry, you did a good job in getting it, but but we can't give you the prize. And it was the Audi. Oh. Oh, man. Will of Fortune contestant Charlene receives what many fans of the show believe she deserves after she controversially lost an Audi Q3 in December due to a timing rule on the longtime game show that many were unaware of. You have 10 seconds to try to talk it out. Good luck. Choosing the right card. Charlene made it to the final round where the category was called, what are you doing? Though she guessed the wrong answer at first, she eventually said the right phrase. Choosing the right word. But it wasn't fast enough causing her at the time to miss out on an Audi Q3. This result set viewers off on social media, with some criticizing the ABC show for having hidden rules. Jeopardy! champion Alex Jacob tweeted, quote, Come on, Will of Fortune. The woman literally chose the right word. Give her the car. Another viewer echoing that sentiment tweeted, quote, She was right. For Pete's sake, Will of Fortune, make it right. Some of us who have been watching you for decades are disgusted. A viewer even suggested that Charlene should have a GoFundMe page so she can, quote, get what she deserves. Well, there's no need for a GoFundMe page now because Audi has heard the outcry loud and clear. Shortly after the episode aired, the company tweeted, quote, you're a winner in our eyes, Charlene. Now let's get you a prize. Time to give her the Q3. They followed up with this tweet, quote, there's no community like the Audi community. With your help, we track down Charlene. More to come as we help give her the Q3. And this past Thursday, Audi tweeted a photo of a smiling Charlene, beaming with joy standing next to her new car, topped with a big red bow, holding up the car keys. They captioned the photo, quote, you all did it. You helped give her the Q3. Charlene, welcome to the Audi family. We're so happy to see you in the driver's seat. Now, when it comes to Wheel of Fortune and how long 74-year-old Pat Sajak plans to host the iconic game show, here's what he and his TV partner, Vanna White, told ET in September. I don't know. We're, you know, we're certainly close. I can speak for both of us. We're certainly closer to the end than the beginning. Um, every time a contract comes up, you think about it. I mean, for me, uh, I'd like to leave while the show's still popular. I'd like to leave while... Um, uh, I'd like to leave before people tune in and look at me and say, ooh, what happened to him? So, uh, you know, we're getting close. I, I don't know. I'm not trying to be teasing. I, I don't exactly know. But it's not, I wouldn't bet on it seeing us in 10 years, I would say. Is that fair? Probably, yes.